What's up everybody? Welcome to my new video. Today we are building a new project. The Digital Hourglass. I don't know what it is yet, but we're about to find out. In this project, you will build a clock that turns an LED on every 10 minutes. The clock uses the Arduino's Uno built-in timer. Yeah, uh, that makes sense. Uh, I know in JavaScript there's like a timer function, so if it's continuously looping, yeah, that makes sense. That it could be doing something like that. Tilting it back and forth. All right, let's continue. Um, okay, so this is the basics. I said this in the last video, and I forgot the name of it. Is it a cir circuit diagram? I think it was. It's not, it's not here today for some reason. I forgot it. I forgot the name of the type of diagram, but here we have the, I'm assuming it's, we're using 220 ohm resistors, six of them, and then six LEDs. Um, I, I don't know what colors they're gonna be, but here we have, we have them connected. This little sign right here, I'm assuming they're not connected. I think that's what that little jump is. And then so, so that would mean that the tilt switch would be connected, boom here, eight, and then boom directly to 10K. A 10K resistor to ground. It's kind of weird, huh? And then these go around, then connected. That's, that's kind of weird. We'll see how, how it goes. Let's just kind of read this through real quick. In the circuit, oh yeah, so circuit diagram. Notice that the tilt sensor is hooked up to a digital pin, not an analog. This is a binary switch. Okay. It's either tilted or it's not tilted. Okay. Analog usually, I believe, is the, that zero, the 1023. I think that's what analog means. I'm not too sure though. So right here, it's looking like it's going to be either on or off to turn it on or tilt it the other way to turn it off. Binary. Every 10 minutes, so we saw that already. Build of materials. I won't bring out the materials like I did the other day. I just, I brought out the materials and then, okay, I just, I'll just bring them out just so you can see them. One tilt sensor. What's a tilt sensor? Oh, is that a iPhones have this. Uh, it reminds me of the name of, of potentiometer, but it's not. The potentiometer was, I believe, a little, a knob. The tilt switch. Hmm. I remember it because I, I remember when they announced an iPhone. They went, they did that little x-ray that they do. So obviously, tilt switch. Let's just look it up. Let's see. Tilt sensor? Oh, this is it. Uh -huh. It reminds me, okay, so now it, now it kind of reminds me of the, the, like what you use in construction with the green liquid and just, it tilts back and forth. There's a different type of tilt sensor. How does this one work? That's not what I meant to do. What is that, terminal? Okay. Well, anyways. <clears throat> One 10k resistor. Should I do it right now? I could connect it, but it's not gonna. It's not gonna work because I don't have the code for it. Should I just connect it just to connect it for practice? We'll do it for practice. Okay, so we're gonna do. What is that? Five volts. I always gotta check. For all these projects, it's always been five volts. So we're gonna go ahead and go with five volts right here that's gonna be a red then we're gonna go ground which is gonna be a black then we're gonna go we're gonna grab six LEDs all red six of them and then we're gonna have some resistors but I'll look at that later all right so there's six of those it's gonna be starting from the from the bottom and then we're gonna have them separated by two oof okay it's a little bit different i need to flip them flip all of them 
I can't select all of them. Flip them. I have to do them all manually. Flip them. The long leg is the leg that's kind of bent a little bit. I believe that the long leg is the terminal. The one that goes to the ground. Okay, so it's at the very end, right? It's separated by two. Very end, separated by two. Very end, separated by two. Separated by two. Just like that. Simple, right? Separated by two. And then we have a tilt switch. It's gonna be a little bit different though. It's a little bit different. See, I don't know how this is gonna work. What happened to the wire that I had here? Am I chirping? Or did that wire disappear? Or did I never connect it? I might have not connected it. Okay, let's get rid of this here. This one as well. Oh, why is it? Why is it? Oh no. Why is it connecting? There it is. Okay. What's next? Let's do this part here. So, left pin to um, left pin to power. Left pin to power. That's a red. Right pin to ground, but a. 10k resistor a 10k resistor 10 right here to ground that's the right pin 10k resistor in between those we're gonna have digital to 8 digital to pin 8 in between those, digital to pin 8, and it's green. Alright, and now as for these over here. Left pin. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Okay. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Left pin. Okay, this is going to be kind of weird. Hold on yellow left pin okay left pin was it seven to two okay left pin we'll do this six left pin i think this is correct i'm not sure though then we have 220 220 ohm resistors those go to ground so we'll grab a resistor, we'll change it to, to 20 regular ohms, then I'll go ahead and copy, paste it, six of them, two more, one more. Okay, so it's kind of weird here because the cables are intertwined, but it's, it's too ground, right? I think it's to ground. Was it to power? Let me see. That one was to ground. This one as well. To ground. Okay. It just looks kind of weird because the cables are on the bottom. Again, there's no code right now, so like I don't expect it to work. But you never know. Some stuff works just like that. Let's see here. Sometimes simulating. Yeah, it's, it's absolutely. That's just stock code. There's nothing there. What is that supposed to be? Like, the more it's tilted, the more lights there is? Or? Yeah, so... Yeah, there's no code. Let me start it again. Yeah, so this one doesn't work. I'm thinking that when they do the updated version, this is an old, an old design. I'm thinking most likely this is going to be designed in a different way. Because this is like compact right here. The pins are right next to each other over here. The pins are pretty far, so most likely something's different here. I think so, but we'll see. 
yeah so that's gonna be all for today thank you guys for watching y'all have a good ass day peace out